Good morning, guys. It is Tuesday, 10 21 in the morning. And yes, you are seeing Ryan in the background. He is playing hooky today from school because we have a few appointments and it just conflicted with his school schedule. So on Thursday, I have to register this big boy in kindergarten, but he needed um, to go to the dentist because he needed some forms from the dentist and then also his pediatrician. He's already up to date with his five-year checkup with his, like, his shots and everything that he needs, like his hearing test, his vision test, all of that, but he did not have the correct paperwork for the dentist. So I had to make a dentist appointment for him today. Then I also have another checkup for my jaw to make sure that it is still healing correctly and I still have the stitches in. The stitches have to stay in until I think the 23rd. So they just wanna check it out again, make sure everything's healing correctly. Thankfully, I'm not getting any more pain. Thank goodness because the pain I could not take it anymore now it's just more of like an uncomfortable feeling because of the stitches in my mouth but other than that I'm not getting any more pain so that's a good thing so yeah other than that we have to like I said right now we're in the parking lot of my dentist's office we're a little bit early so we're sitting in the car so after my appointment then we have to go to his pediatrician and pick up the paperwork for the school and then I have to get some lunch for me and the kids. Then after that, it'll be time for his dentist appointment. Go to his dentist appointment. And then I really need to go to either Walmart or Target. Madison's on her last little package of wipes. And I also need to get her diapers. So we will either go to Target or Walmart, depending on how late it is. Um, I kind of wanted to go to Walmart because I needed to exchange something but Walmart is kind of out of the way. So if it's too late after his appointment, we might just go to Target just because it's closer. But if we have time, then we'll go to Walmart so I can exchange these pair of pants that I bought. That I really do like them, they're really cute, but I feel like I'm never going to wear them. So yeah, that is the plan for today. So I want to vlog a little today. And Ryan, are you excited to be out of school today? Take that go. Take that go. Are you excited for your first dentist appointment? <laughs> yeah? No? Maybe? Yeah. What do you want for lunch? <laughs> oh god, he's silly. I want Chick-fil-A for Chick-fil-A! This boy is obsessed with Chick-fil-A. Anyone else's kids as obsessed with Chick-fil-A as mine? Because anytime I ask him where he wants to go for lunch, it's always Chick-fil-A. I think I might pick up, um, for Ryan, I'll probably get him his Chick-fil-A, but for me and Madison, I think I'm going to get some, like, tacos or something for us because I love tacos. So I think me and Madison will have tacos and Ryan will have Chick-fil-A. But anyways, guys, I'm going to start getting the kids out of the car and head into my appointment, and then I'll see you guys a little later. Dentist appointment. And we are waiting to be called. We have a little play area. Where are we? What are you doing? Um, I'm playing a game and he's like, rrr, rrr. Yeah. And he's spin around. So this appointment is just for um, Ryan because I have to register him on school on Thursday. And then once our insurance starts again in June, I'll have to come back for medicine. She needs her checkup as well. But let's see how this goes. Ryan, so far, you're really excited for his dentist appointment. Are you excited for your dentist appointment? Yeah, and this is going really fast now. Look. Well, that is going really fast. The little waiting area is really cute. They have some toys for the kids. So, and they have a tablet. <laughs> but Madison's in the stroller. I tried to get her to run around and play, but she kept on trying to go to the back. So I had a seclude, not seclude her. I had to trap her in the little stroller. You, you don't get that disappointment today. And you're playing with daddy's little golf pick, aren't you? But they have a little play area there and they have some magazines. It's really cute in here. And of course Ryan chooses to go on the tablet. So we're really early, huh? Alright, can you, can you scoot your bottom all the way back on the chair? Because right now you're just laying your shoulders. Can you scoot this Scoot part? your butt all the way back. There you go. Good job. Fish like this. Can you practice? Close your lips. Perfect for you, okay? 
She's gonna clean it. She's gonna clean all that Chick Fil A you just ate. Okay. What flavor toothpaste do you want me to use today? I've got fruit um, punch, bubble gum, or cookie. Um, is it is the cookie one chocolate? Mm-hmm. Um, I'll have the fruit punch one. Okay. <laughs> I thought he was gonna go for the cookie one. Okay. And for your vitamins we paint on your teeth, do you want cupcake or melon? I think I have cupcake. Okay. Because I don't want cupcake. Okay. You're gonna hurt your eyes, okay? Okay. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna raise you up. We're gonna go up, okay? Okay. Up, 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 up. And then we're gonna go back. You're gonna lay in my lap, okay? Bless you. It's like it's like our couch. Our couch. <laughs> it doesn't go that far back, but. It almost lied you. Okay. Good Sounds job. Good. Thank you. And you're five. Is that right? Punch toothpaste in my brush like that. Okay. It's just like the toothbrush at home that we have. It's electric. We brush your teeth, okay? Okay. And then I want to show you this guy right here. This is Mr. Thirsty. He's a straw. And when I turn him on, he's like mommy's vacuum cleaner watch. And he likes to eat toothpaste. Do you like to eat toothpaste? No. no. <laughs> so he eats it for you, okay? Sorry, mommy, and they brushed my teeth. She'll be so oh, excited. For me. And you know what? I have a little boy who's Delaney's age, so he's your age too, and I just brushed his teeth the other day. So we know all about Handsome little boys getting their teeth brushed. Hey guys, and good morning. It is thir no, not Thursday. What? No, Thursday. I don't even know my days. It's Thursday, and today is <coughs> muffins with mom. God bless you. Um, today's muffins with mom. I'm sorry about this light. I'm in the car. Let me see if maybe. Nope, I didn't do it. Maybe a little bit. Anyways, guys. Um, yeah, it's muffins with mom today, and. Today, it's like no point in me bringing him to school because today we have to register him for school. So his pre-K is letting us take the kids home with us after Muffins with Mom is over. It starts at 9.20, Muffins with Mom, and then it ends at 10. So they said after, we can just take the kids home with us because we need the kids with us in order to register them. And I guess some parents still have to do last minute um, stuff like at the doctor. So I'm literally going to drop him off and then 15, 20 minutes later is when I go in for the muffins with mom. And then after that, I just take him home with me. So basically I am just bringing him to school so I can eat muffins with him and then he's leaving with me. So yeah, that's what's gonna happen today. And then I also have to go to um, the pharmacy and pick up my medication so guys I went to the doctors yesterday because I've been getting a lot of migraines and headaches to the point where I am super nauseous and it's just it's just really bad and I've been getting it like every single day so I went to the doctors and um, they prescribed me um, some medicine for my headaches to see if it'll work but and then the doctor also just diagnosed me with anxiety. I always had a feeling that I had anxiety, but I was never actually diagnosed with anxiety from my doctor. So yesterday I was diagnosed with anxiety. So now this is something new for me. He, so yeah, he prescribed me a medication for my anxiety that I had to pick up from the pharmacy. And yeah, I'm, I need to do more research on it because I'm not too um, educated on the medication that he has prescribed me. And I... I'm that type of person that doesn't like to be put on medications. So yeah, I had to research the medication that he prescribed to me. I'm not even sure what the name is. He did tell me the name, but I'm not sure what it was. I know it wasn't Xanax because one of my friends who also has anxiety, she said that her doctor prescribed to her that. And I was talking to her, but I told her it wasn't Xanax because I know he said it was it wasn't Xanax. It was something else. I'm just not sure what the name was. So yeah, now I'm dealing with that. Um, and then also I have to get a CAT scan done on my brain because he said the fact that I'm getting migraines and headaches every single day to the point where I'm nauseous and it's just so severe. He just wants to rule out anything bad just to be on the safe side. Comment down below, let me know. I don't know if it's a CAT scan or MRI when you are put into that machine. It's like a round machine that you're like put into and it's really claustrophobic in there. I don't, but the thing is, I don't know if it's a MRI or a CAT scan. Hopefully it's not MRI because I get really claustrophobic. And if they put me in that machine, I'm pretty sure I'm going to have a panic attack. So we're going to see how that goes. I'm hoping that it's not that machine that you're put in because if so, I will definitely have to take that 
anxiety medicine that he's prescribing me before I go to that appointment, which I also have to call and make that appointment as well. But yeah, anyways, guys, let me stop a rambling. Um, carpool lane is about to start moving, so I will see you guys inside. I'm going to vlog a little bit of the muffins with mom. Probably won't vlog too much just because obviously there are going to be other kids and parents in there, and I just don't know, you know, if they would want to be on YouTube. So I'm gonna try my best to get as many clips as possible for you guys, okay, and then we'll have okay, to do a few errands. Alright guys, see you guys in a little bit. Hi buddy. Hi yeah, buddy. Madison. You made a caterpillar? Wow, is this for me? <laughs> That's so cute, buddy. Ooh, I like that caterpillar. Let's see. Let's How is your mom? How is your dad? How about my mom? I'm 23. Well, my job is cleaning. <laughs> That's so cute. To lead, to guide, to direct. Every time we reach out those hands, whether it be for a hug or to redirect, let it be come from you. Give us the wisdom to know. Oh. Give us the guidance, give us the Holy Spirit to teach us because as Hey guys, yeah, I'm back in the car. It is now 11.40, turn on this air. It's now 11.40 in the parking lot of Cosmo Prof because I want to pick up some more hair stuff. I have um a shampoo, I think it's, is it Redken? Yeah, it's Redken shampoo and I want to get the conditioner to it. So that's what I'm here for. And then also I want to look for a really good deep conditioner and then maybe just some other hair products. So I'm at Cosmoprof, but I'm in the parking lot waiting for my friend Angie to get here. And my and, friend Bolivia. And Bolivia, but we did muffins with mom this morning and it was so cute. This is so hilarious, you guys. Ryan had a little, um, like a little list of things they had to write down about his mom, me. And the things he wrote down is hilarious. If you guys don't already follow me on Instagram, then follow me. I'll have my Instagram name right here. I did post it on Instagram, so if you follow me there, you would have already seen it. But hold on, let me show them. Can I show so them? this is the list. So Can it says all them? about my mom. Hold on, Ryan. So, and now it says my mom is 23 years old. Yes, I wish I was 23 years old. She has brown hair, no, brown eyes and black hair. Her job is to clean. She loves to eat chicken. And this is where I laughed. It says her favorite drink is wine. That is so bad. It's so horrible. But anyways, her favorite drink is wine. She's really good at mopping. And this is another thing that I laughed at. She, he put, she always says, no Madison, which is true. I'm always having to tell Madison no. She is happy when she goes to Madison's room and sees her and she's super because she gives me hugs. I think this is the cutest thing ever. And okay, I love it. Guys. I want to save that. And come down. I, think, I just think that is so cute. And then I'll show you guys when I get home, but there's a few other things that the kids made for us that's so cute. And these are things that I really enjoy getting from the kids. I always look forward to all these handmade, handcrafted little gifts that they give us. And this one by far has been my favorite. They even gave us flowers. Like I'm gonna try to plant it outside. I'm not sure what kind of um flower it is, but it's like one is purple and like two of them is pink. It's so cute. So once I get home, I'll show you guys just because it's in a basket right now and I don't wanna take everything out because the dirt's gonna go everywhere. So yeah. But anyways, guys, we are going to go into Cosmo Prof, and then we have to go home, eat some lunch, and then I have to register Ryan for school. But I did pick up my medication. I'm so mad. The medication for my headache, they didn't have in. I have to go back in tomorrow to pick it up, which sucks because that's the medicine I really wanted was the one for my migraines. But they did have the medicine for my anxiety, but I'm not taking this. I, I paid for this, but I'm not taking it. The anxiety medicine that they prescribed me, I looked it up and I read up on it and it says it can cause so much stuff. It can cause you to be paranoid, it can cause dizziness, it can cause suicide, it can cause um, just like all these things that, I don't know, it just freaked me out and there's like a list of things that it says it could cause um, and it says it can cause suicide. I don't know, there's just a bunch of stuff that it says it can cause and 
that just freaks me out and I'm not taking it. So I'm gonna have to call a doctor and see if he can prescribe something else that's maybe, I don't know, that's not gonna cause all of that. I don't know, comment down below if any of you guys have anxiety and if you take medicine. And I don't know, maybe I'm just being over paranoid, but I just don't wanna take it. So unfortunately I paid for it, but I'm not gonna take it. And hopefully I don't get bad anxiety anytime soon. Um, I will have to talk to him though because whenever I get that MRI, I'm going to need something to calm me down before I get that MRI done. So I don't know what he's gonna have to prescribe to me, but I'm not taking that. Are we gonna go in the big machine? Big machine? I don't wanna go in the big machine. Mama's scared to go in that big machine. But I got the kids some popcorn from Target and I got, well, I got Madison some chocolate milk and he gave it to her. He got an apple juice. And yeah, Madison's in a really bad mood. I really wanted to go to the other Target because they have a really big clearance section that's 30% off with an additional 20% off if you have the Cartwheel app. If you guys don't have the Cartwheel app, you need to download that. Um, so it's a total of 50% off. I want to go grab some more clothes for the kids, but there's no way I think I'm gonna be able to go. Can I get friends something real quick? Yeah, what are you gonna show them? This. Oh, that's something that he made too when he gave me for Mother's Day. It's a little caterpillar. It's really cute. All right, I think Angie's here. Oh, look, hey Angie's here. So it is now a, a few days later, and I just completely forgot to pick up the camera and finish vlogging on Thursday. So I did not end that vlog on Thursday. I'm trying to get better at my vlogs. I'm just not used to always picking up the camera throughout the day. So like I said, I just forgot to pick up the camera for the rest of the day. And today, as I was finishing editing the video so I could upload it today, I realized there was no ending surprise. I always forget to do intros and outros so I just want to end the vlog here and say thank you so much for watching my vlog I hope you guys enjoy my vlogs because you guys are really going to start seeing a lot more vlogs here on my channel because I love vlogs and I like to look back at the vlogs and see the kids and just see our family so like I said I hope you guys enjoy today's vlog and later this week you will probably see one more vlog and then you will see a haul and then I'm going to try to film some type of cleaning video so those are the videos that will probably be up this week and as always if you have not already i would love if you would join me and my youtube family and subscribe to my channel and if you would like to be notified anytime i upload a video just hit that notification bell and it will notify you anytime i upload thank you so much for watching and we will see you guys in our next vlog